the uh, best laid plans of man can uh, sometimes be changed by just a little manipulation. Uh, there you go, right there. Hello, all you wonderful people, and greetings from Tokyo, Japan. Now, right now, you can probably hear the cicadas that are going right behind the camera. It is summertime, it is hot, and the best way to relax in the summertime is with a nice, cool beverage. But we'll get to that part later. You see, I want to talk about a misconception. In America, the word hentai is like illicit and pretty disgusting mango or erotic literature. Out here in Japan, the word hentai means like strange, unusual, weirdo, like a pervert or something like that. And unfortunately, a very popular American company that is in Japan has accidentally produced a hentai, in both sense of the word, drink. Now, I don't want to say the name of the place that's produced this accidental rude cup. Uh, so while you're looking at these One Piece memorabilia, I'll give you a hint of the name of the company, okay? In Japan, their mascot is named Ronald McRonald. Oh yeah, and the mascot is a uh, clown. Well, I think you can figure it out from there. Well, if you excuse me, I'm gonna go inside and purchase this strange little cup that they made. Yep, it's uh, still on the menu. And about $2.50 later, I got this very unassuming cup that's supposed to show two people having a kiss if you drink it all the way through. But there's a lot of people here, so we're gonna move on this one. About five minutes later, we're at a park where there's a lot less people. Which, this in particular, might be a good thing. By the time I made it all the way to the park, almost all the ice is melted. Now, take a good look at this cup. You got the girl here, and the other side. You got a boy, and they're obviously going in for a little pet. Now, the drink inside, there was three of them. There was either Blood Orange, Blue Hawaii, or Lemon Scochu, which is lemonade out here. The drink inside isn't what matters, it's the image on here that does. And with a little magic and a time lapse, I can make this liquid disappear. Ah, that was really, really good for Hawaii. And because of that, how I do have a brain freeze, which I've been told that if you put your tongue to the roof of your mouth, it's supposed to stop that, but, you know, I'll do anything at this point. You know, come to think about it, this whole drink was pretty much ice. I drank it in like 20 seconds. Ah, be gone. All right, now let's let it cool off a little bit so you can see that effect. So it's summer, and in summer there are breaks, and in summer you can have love. Mwah. Mwah. You see, they're, they're kissing each other. That's that's really cute. Mwah. 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 But much like that open condom wrapper that's sitting right there, the uh, best laid plans of man can uh, sometimes be changed by just a little manipulation. Uh, there you go, right there. Hello, how are you? It's good to see you. Wouldn't be fair not to have equal treatment, so yeah. Uh, how you doing? Good to see you too, huh? And that's really sweet. And this, and I mean, and it's amazing how just a couple degrees can change your idea from sweet to, well, frankly, inappropriate. Now, I'm not the first person to figure this out by going a couple degrees. Um, a couple different news sources have said, oh, this is the, well, I'll just say hentai cup to not get demonetized. But it's amazing how this came out of a place of just trying to sell a sweet message into something completely different. And I do want to thank the YouTuber Saramaru for telling me to go check this out. I would have never bought this drink, and I think the packaging was made with the right intentions, but it just takes a couple degrees to change that. But, as I always say, you can do it, I can do it, we can all do it. Stay groovy and have a wonderful day. And uh, if you haven't, click the subscribe button. I'm heading back to Osaka in a couple days to go check out Universal Studios Japan. But until then, stay groovy. Peace.